Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares, and this is going to be a tag video for the Metal Up Your Ass tag. Now, I'm going to be moving through these kind of quickly because there is 17 questions. Um, and this is for, of course, Sean Urshan and my buddy Horror, Hellhound. Hellhound, yeah. Um, we're going to go with number one, and that is the best guitar solo. I thought a lot about this one. Now, I consider Joe Satriani metal. Some people may not. Some people consider instrumental music as a separate thing. But I consider it metal, and one of my favorite solos of all time is uh, Always With Me, Always With You. So that's that's going to be my answer for number one. Uh, question number two has kind of a two-part question. Um, what band got you into metal? When I was younger, and I, I'm trying to think of when this album actually came out with, came out. It's a uh, Quiet Riot. I got the album for Christmas, um, the one with uh, Slick Black Cadillac and and all those. Um, I'm trying to think of the name of the album, Mental Health. Um, but yeah, that kind of steered me towards it. But my buddy and I used to go into the record store, and this was like maybe a couple years later. We used to go into the record store and we used to try to pick the most the coolest cover of something and we would just buy it as a you know never listening to it first time i did that i picked up um megadeth uh, p cells but who's buying and it was metal ever since so yeah um question number three who is your favorite metal vocalist now this is a tough one i think uh uh, Chris Cornell, uh, R.I.P., has uh, one of the best vocalist, best vocal stylings of anyone ever. But um, my favorite is actually Eric Martin from Mr. Big, which is kind of a, I guess, a double-edged sword because his styling isn't really metal. It's more like an R&B put to metal. But that's my answer. So, yeah, Eric Martin. Um, what is your favorite metal album? Also a tough one. Um, I have to give two answers for that. It's probably, uh, Peace Sells But Who's Buying from Megadeth and Badlands from Badlands. Uh, question number five. Who is the best classic metal band? To me, that's got to be Black Sabbath. Um, they were the ones who originally did it. I know, you know, they call them the Godfather's Metal. You also have Led Zeppelin as well, but, you know, it's got to be Black Sabbath for me. The riffs, the solos, Ozzy, it's just, yeah. Okay, um, question number six. Who is the best thrash metal band? Uh, for me, that's Megadeth. It's kind of a close one between Megadeth and Metallica, but I've always liked Megadeth just a little bit more. Uh, question number seven is, <clears throat> who is the best death metal band? Now, I'm going to be honest. I don't really listen to death metal. It's not a style that I really care for, but so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to skip that one. Uh, let's see. Question number eight, who is the best 90s metal band? Um, I have two answers for that. One is Rage Against the Machine, although I think they started in the very late 80s, maybe 89, but it could have been 90. Um, and also uh, Stone Temple Pilots. Some people consider them grunge, some people consider them metal. Eh, you know. Uh, question number nine. Who, in your opinion, is the heaviest band? <laughs> now, you didn't say good band, you said heaviest. There was a band that my buddy bought a, and I, I shared this with Dave, um, Dave Maggot. My buddy bought a album, um, Executioner, and I can't remember the name of the album, but it's just heavy, but it's also garbage, so. Let's see. Question number 10. Uh, Black Sabbath, Ozzy or Dio? Um, I love Ronnie James Dio. I thought he was incredible. He was great in, in Black Sabbath. He was great in Rainbow. Um, he was great on his own. Um, but I have to go with Ozzy. Um, Ozzy had my favorite songs from Black Sabbath. So 
it's it's got to be Ozzy for me. Uh, question number eleven: <clears throat> Who is the greatest metal guitarist of all time? I mean, there are so many great ones. Uh, you have Ingve, you have um, Vinnie Moore, who branched off and went to uh, UFO and stuff like that. There's millions of great guitar players out there, but to be honest, my favorite is Paul Gilbert. Uh, he played with Racer X for a while, or he still does off and on, did his own solo thing, and also was in Mr. Big. I mean, the guy is pound for pound the best guitar player out there. I think Buckethead is probably a close second for me, but anyway. Number 12, who is the greatest metal drummer? Um, I have to say Scott Rockenfeld. Um, I've always liked him from Queensryche. And even though I've always loved the band Queensryche, <clears throat> it took me to be friends with a uh, metal drummer that I was playing with at the time to really sit me down and break down what he was playing and the technicality of what he was playing. It's He's an amazing drummer. Um, question number 13. Who is the greatest bass player? Uh, it's got to be Steve Harris from Iron Maiden. He's amazing. Um, I've always liked him. Maiden is awesome. I mean, you, you really can't do much better than him other than Getty Lee, but I don't really consider that metal. But Okay, who is the best metal band of today? That is a tough one. Um, I hear some of the stuff occasionally. Uh, one of my favorite guitar players of all time is Jakey e. Lee, who used to play with Ozzy, and he played with Badlands. He did have the uh, Red Dragon Cartel, which I've listened to some of their stuff, and I kind of liked it, so I guess I have to go with that. I don't listen to a lot of metal today. I just, I like the older stuff. Um, question number 15. Who is the best alternative metal band? I would have to go with Rage Against the Machine. I thought what they did was completely different, and it still blows me away to this day. And I'm not really a rap fan. I don't really like rap music, but Rage Against the Machine is awesome. So, uh, Number 16, who has the coolest gimmick in metal? <laughs> Some people consider them rock and roll. Some people consider them metal. I consider them both, and that's Kiss. I mean... You can't deny the impact that they've had on music and um, marketing and stuff like that. And question number 17. Who is the greatest metal band of all time? Um, I have to say uh, Mr. Big. And the reason why I say that is because they have Eric Martin as a lead singer, who's my favorite. Uh, Paul Gilbert as a guitar player, who's my favorite metal guitarist. Um, Billy Sheehan on bass, who is incredible, and uh, I believe the late Pat Torfey on drums. I don't know who they have now, but um, he was the only one that kind of, Pat Torfey wasn't um, well known. And they were just, <laughs> they were an incredible band. Uh, not sure what they're doing now. I hope they're kind of going on without him. I know they were touring. Um, and he was just playing a little bit, and they had another drummer filling in. But, um, yeah, incredible band, incredible band. And that's it. Um, I'm not really sure who to tag, because I'm not sure who's in the metal, other than Sean and uh, Hellhound and Dave Maggot. Um, and I think all those people have been tagged. So I'm going to leave this open-ended, and if you want to do it, definitely do it. It's a fun one. And um, until next time, guys. Peace.